Well, what's going on, Pokey Gang? It's your boy King Atlas Slock, and we are back at it with another video. And today, we are at PopCon 2024 in Orlando, Florida. Let's get it. All right, guys, we just got our, our wristband. So let's see what's good with it. This convention is basically about Funko Pops. I love going to conventions. Well, for one, it's where I get most of my content when it comes to the Eeveelutions or any other uh, Pokemon trivia. But I love seeing stuff like this. Check this out. We got Sonic. We got Lilo and Stitch. Some pretty cool backpacks. I've never been into Funko Pops like that. I got a couple of them because people have gifted them to me. But I'm hoping I see something cool, you know. Got some wrestling ones right here. We got John Cena and The Rock, Triple H and Shawn Michaels in a wrestling ring. We got Avatar The Last Airbender. We got Azula Korra. We got Morbius as a zombie. Iron Patriot. I'm starting to see why people collect this. This is pretty fire, especially if you can get like the voice actor to sign. We got some more backpacks over here. We got Pikachu, we got Snorlax, Squirtle, Bulbasaur. We got a Pokeball. This one's lit. This is the original 151 on a backpack, all of them. But that's fire. We got some Nintendo DS's, some Nintendo 3DS's, some Game Boys, some Game Boy Advance SP's. This is crazy. Look at all these classic Pokemon games. We got some Pokemon 151 full art cards. I have yet to master set it. I had to take a break it was too expensive check this out guys check out this wall this is so dope got the mystery machine we got homer simpson we got ravenclaw from harry potter we got scooby doo we got gryffindor look at rock lee this is all 3d check this out that's fire we got charmander we got krillin oh we got naruto we got darth vader we got the death star we got scorpion Ahsoka, got the Ninja Turtles. Look at Goku, Captain America, that's fire. All right guys, I just found a vintage section. Check this out guys. This is crazy. Look at this. We got Marvel vs. Capcom 2. We got the PSPs, we got, we got some Game Boy Advances. This is probably the dopest section I've seen so far in this whole, all vintage, all classic. Check them out guys, Gamer Zinc, check them out near UC Evan. If you're in the, if you're in the Orlando area, check them out, all, all vintage classics guys. Psyduck, we got Charmander and Blastoise, we got Eevee in the back. Look at this, Pikachu mixed with Chewbacca, Charmander mixed with Darth Maul. This is crazy. So many pops guys, so many pops. No wonder people collect these things. These are so fire. I can't get over how many they are. How many different kinds, different versions. I can see why it's an addicting habit to collect them all. I like going to conventions. Sometimes I don't got enough money to buy anything. I admit that. But I like to go just because I like to see shit I've never seen before. We got Amy. Check this out. We got King. <laughs> Don't even be sweet. Kane and Edge, bro. I did not know WWE had pops like that. And you guys know me as a professional wrestler. This is so dope to see. And of course, the OG, we got Tommy from the Power Rangers. The legend himself, my hero. We got Billy, Alpha 5, Kimberly, Jason. We got all the Power Rangers, man. We got Rita, we got Zach. Oh, snap, we got autograph signed by Yandu. I think that's uh, the dude who plays Murrow in The Walking Dead. Pax, check this out, man. We got some Eevee. We got Blue's Clues. This is fire right here. Into the Spider-Verse, we got Miles and Gwen. It changes. There you go. You see Gwen. I'm sorry, you see Gwen. And then now you see Miles. We got a Loki pack. Big-ass Batman pop. Yo, I understand why y'all collecting this now. I get it. We got Goku and Krillin. I get it, guys. We got a Randy Orton pop. We got... Shawn Michaels, we got Triple H. We got a Liv Morgan. I've never seen so many Funko Pops before in one place. Now I get it. I get why you guys are addicted to this stuff. I'm gonna have to get a couple myself. Some of y'all are probably looking at me like, these are just regular Polly, but I don't know anything about Funkos like that. 
So to me, this is all dope as shit. I don't know what's worth a lot of money, which ones aren't. I don't know what's rare, what's not. We got a Happy Meals one. This one. This is fire. I don't even know how you're supposed to put this on. I wouldn't even know the first thing about it. Look at that. We got Boo. Monster Zinc. All right, guys. The best part about these uh, conventions is the voice actors. You get to meet the voice actors. I know that Gohan's voice actor is here. She voiced uh, Team Gohan. She voiced Kid Goku. Um, so I'm going to see if I get a chance to meet her and get my first pop signature. Let's make some history, guys. All right, guys. We are here in Stephanie Nadoni's line. She is a legend in Dragon Ball Z. This is going to be my first ever... This is gonna be my first ever signature on a pop, my first autograph pop. Let's get it, guys. I really appreciate it. <laughs> it's like a dream come true. I love, I love Dragon Ball Z. Thank you for taking the time. I appreciate it. Look at that, guys. She got it. Thank you so much. All right, guys. We are back with some more Funkos. We got some cool shit over here. We got Deku. We got Gran Torino. We got Mina Naruto's dad. Check this out, guys. We have Mr. Burns, glowing Mr. Burns. Remember that old alien episode when they were trying to figure out who the alien was and it was just Mr. Burns? Oh, that's crazy. We got Boruto right here. We got Infinite Deku. We got some crazy shit up top. We got the Hollywood Tower of Terror Funko Pop. Yo, this go hard. This goes hard. Check this out, guys. We got the Spider-Man meme. That's crazy, yo. We got LeBron James. We got All Might. Let me know down in the comments what y'all think. Let me know down in the comments, guys. Is there anything rare in here? Anything I need to know about? Remember, I'm new. This is my first time ever being around pops like that. So let me know. All right, guys, check this out. We got a Susano, Sasuke Susano. We got a Baymax, the Mandalorian. We got Boba Fett. We got Spyro. This is crazy. We got Optimus Prime. We got some bigger pops. We got from Spider-Man, No Way Home. We got Hulk. <laughs> Look at the Hulk from Thor Ragnarok. Look at Pikachu. I get the addiction, guys. I understand. We got Jack Skellington. It's amazing. These pops get more and more expensive the more that I explore. This is pop heaven, guys. We got Gara, Anbu Itachi, Goku Ultra Instinct. We got Vegeta. This Vegeta won't go hard. I'm not going to lie. Itachi, Mavara. We got Jiraiya. We got Kakashi with a Chidori in his hand. We got Super Saiyan Future Trunks. Hit the Dragon Ball Z jackpot over here, guys. We got Trunks again. This Trunk one lit, I'm not gonna lie. Super Saiyan 2 Vegeta. We got Krillin. Look at Majin Buu eating ice cream. For $100, we got the Agent Anti-Venom. That shit going tough. This wall might be the exclusive wall. Look at these prices, 60, 85. $80, 80 70 220 for the Logan. 245 for Hordak. Nick Fury. We got a Hey Arnold one for 80 Robin, $350. Superman, 200 Hawkman, 220 $550 for Green Lantern. This is crazy. We got the signs at the bottom. These ones are all signed by their voice actors. So I understand these prices. The Naruto voice actor signed this one. Aaron Yeager, 500 for the Aaron Yeager. 250 for the One Piece. These prices are crazy, 220. I'm new to the game. These are some of the most expensive prices I've ever seen on um, on these Funkos so far for the day. Let me know down in the comments, guys, if you know any Funkos that are more expensive than this. This has to be the most expensive pop I've seen so far. 
Obi Wan Kenobi for two thousand dollars. That's crazy right there. All right, guys, I just found something crazy: an Eight Mile B Rabbit Funko signed by Eminem himself. Check this out, guys. This is crazy. According to the seller, there's only four of these in the world, and this is one of them. Now I see why y'all collect Funko Pops, man. More and more, I'm starting to understand the culture. I might be joining y'all on this. It's tight work. All right, guys. That was day one of PopCon 2024. It's a two-day con event. I might do tomorrow because I got the weekend pass. I might, I might not. I did everything I wanted to do today. You know, I got a chance to explore the culture and the world of, of, of the... Uh, of the Funko Pops, which is something that I've never done before. I got my first couple Pops. Um, I got a chance to meet Stephanie Nadoni, and she signed my first Pop, the voice actors for Teen Gohan and Kid Goku. That was pretty fire. It might be the highlight of my day, but I'm going to end things on a high note. I'm going to go to Super Saiyan here in Orlando, Florida, in honor of, of Akira Toriyama. Check it out, guys. I'm going to go to Super Saiyan. Let's end the day on a high note. Let's ride. Check it out, guys. Yeah. We got Ultra Instinct Goku. We got Super Saiyan Vegeta. That's pretty fire, guys. Check that out. All right, guys. We're trying out Super Saiyan. Let's get that first bite. Oh, yeah. He's not hitting, bro. Let's try out the egg rolls, guys. Yeah, man. They hit him.